Hello and welcome to Quick Tips. So in this video, we will see how to add a sidebar in Hello Elementor theme. Now by default, the Hello Elementor theme does not have widgets option and we cannot add a sidebar to the Hello Elementor theme. However, we can do it manually by adding some code in the functions file of this theme. So let's see how we can do this. So this is the code that we are going to add in the functions files. You will see this code in the description box or you will see this link where you can find this code. This code is available on Elementor website. I'll give you the link in the description box. Let's go back to the website. Now under appearance, go to theme file editor. Now go to functions.php. This is the file, click on it. Scroll down to the end and here add the code. Here paste the code that we have copied and click on update file. All right, now refresh the dashboard. Now here you will see the option widgets. Click on it. Now you will see that the default sidebar section has been activated and you can add widgets so let's add some widgets okay now here is the plus button or you can click on this plus button and you will see all the widgets here so let's start with post we will add some recent post so you can see the options here let's select this one enter it here now these are the settings of this post post content excerpt or if you want full post you can show the full post author name post date so these are the settings of the latest post it will show five posts right now we do not have post we have only one post here okay now add one more widget let's say add button add button let's name it as read more whatever widget you want to add you can add the widgets let's change the color and add the link all right so this is the second widget if you want to add more you can add more let's add image all right so we have added three blocks so let's click on update okay now let's go to pages and uh, this is a sample page. So click on edit with Elementor. We are going to show the sidebar on this page. And we are using Elementor basic plugin, not the pro one. Now click on this and select the section. Let's add some padding here. Right, so in this right hand side column we are going to show the sidebar so click on this plus button and click on and search for sidebar here you will see the sidebar select it and draw drop it here okay here it shows two sidebar so this is the name of the sidebar sidebar one selected and click on update okay let's add some content here So this is the dummy content for this page all right so we have got the sidebar here so click update and now let's see how the page looks so this is a very basic sidebar okay now if you delete this button from the widget section let's delete this one and click update now let's refresh this page and you will see that the button has been deleted all right so this is how you can add sidebar you can actually uh, customize this also you can customize this column let's add some style here let's update it all 
All right, so you can see that we have added some styling to the column. This is how you can add the sidebar manually to a single page. However, what if you want to add the sidebar throughout the website to all the pages? So you cannot do it manually on all the pages. So instead of manually adding sidebar to all the pages, you can do it using the template feature of the Elementor. For that, you will need Elementor Pro plugin. So let's go to plugin. And I do have Elementor Pro installed on this website. So let's activate the Elementor Pro. Okay, now close all the other windows. Let's go to template and then go to save template. Okay, now we are going to create a template for the sidebar. So instead of using the widgets option, this option, this one looks very basic. So we are going to use a template to create a sidebar. Okay, let's go to template and click on add new. Select section and name it as a sidebar and click on create template. Let's close this one. Okay, now we will be using it as full. So select the full section. And here we are going to add some blog post. So let's add post, look for post and you will see recent post here. Enter it here. Now it will be, so everything is going into sidebar. So it will be one column classic leave the other options as it is and add one more option here let's add button okay so this is the button and then add image select an image here Or let's instead of image let's select gallery photo gallery so basic gallery and let's have two columns and add some Egypt images one two three four insert gallery so it will be the gallery Okay, so we got some spacing also okay now let's click on publish done now let's go back to the pages and click on edit with elementor so instead of using sidebar we are going to use the template that we have created okay now let's delete this option Okay, now click on the plus sign and look for a template. Drag it and drop it here. And here select sidebar. Now you will see the sidebar template here. So that basic template, the basic widget was not looking good. So we are using the template for the sidebar. So let's update it and view the page all right you can see that this one looks better than the basic one if you want to use this sidebar on all the blog posts you can use the same sidebar and use it on all the blog posts by default so let's see how we can do this so you can see the blog post looks like this so let's add a sidebar on this blog post which will appear on all the blog posts so let's go back to the templates and go to theme builder here is the single post click on add new single post and enter the template name that will be single post sidebar with sidebar and create template close this one okay now let's add section here add some padding 
okay now here we are going to add inner section so this will be the right column okay here we are going to add the template the sidebar template that we created Okay, now here you will see the post title first then we will add the post content after that if you want to add other information you can add other information like post info okay you, you can manage this from here Okay, so this is now this is the current one and let's publish this one add the condition all singular all post okay now save and close now let's refresh this one now you will see this blog post that we just rearranged this is the title the blog info post info and this is the content and this is the sidebar that we just created using the template when you use the template you will need elementor pro plugin and if you want to use the simple sidebar then you can simply add that code and activate the widget section so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.